a quick question because I'm a, I'm a big R&B fan myself and mm. obviously my favorite genre is R&B. Yes, sir. What would you say, if you, could, if you can't give me your favorite, maybe a top three R&B songs of all time? Top three R&B songs. And you can put your time. ones in because generally they they are contenders. Uh, let me see. Michael Jackson's Lady in My Life. That ranks very, very yeah, high. Yeah, there we go. Um, hmm, let me see. Um, damn, man, anything Prince has ever made. <laughs> um, it's, ah, he just one of them dudes. Like, there's no, I, I challenge anybody to try to replicate a Prince song accurately. You can't do yeah, it. Yeah, accurately. I know what you mean. Voices, yeah. voices just don't Different. do that no more. Yeah. Shout out to the boy. Um. Uh, anything Stevie Wonder's ever made. Like Stevie yeah. Wonder is one of the, I have I have five kings. It's like five artists to where if I can meld them all together into one person, that's who I always aspire for Neo to be. So it's like uh, Michael Jackson, Prince, Stevie Wonder, Sammy Davis Jr., and Marvin Gaye. Those are some elite, Take those elite, elite, elite vocals. Elite. Throw them in a pot and stir Mix. it up and make that <laughs> joint and then you come out with Neo. Yeah. That's, at least that's what, I, that's what I've always tried to do. And where, and where does it come from? Like why, why those five... Um, Growing up, was it something like your parents? Maybe I don't I like. Oh yeah, yeah. No, my mom is I, my mom. I give her full credit for for my love for music. So I grew up in Las Vegas, uh, which is weird because you know it's, 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 a, it's a tourist town. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah exactly. People don't live in Vegas. You yeah. visit Vegas and you mm -hmm. go home. Well, Vegas was home. So my mom was you know in and out of casinos, doing every pretty much every job that you could do in Vegas. My mom did. She was she was a kino runner. She was a dealer. She was a a, a, a bartender here, a waitress over there, whatever, whatever, whatever. So every night. She would bring home a different genre of music, and I, I'm I've been a night out my whole life, so I'd be up knowing I needed to be at sleep to go to school the next day. But I'd be up when she got home, and we would just sit and listen to all these different genres of music. Now, initially, it was you know your Michael Jacksons, your the OJ's, and you know a lot of R and B. But then it was like Wayne Newton. Oh uh, wow! Uh, the, the the Rat Pack, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Reba yeah, McIntyre, yeah. Country, like all kind of stuff, and that just kind of developed my love for 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 melody and harmony as opposed to just a specific genre of music. Mm. It became just a love for music overall. So yeah, yeah, definitely credit moms for that. Shout out moms.